So we back with another video. Today we got y'all boys with the best dribble animations in the game. Uh, we gonna go over everything in this video. Escape moves, uh, dribble styles, everything you need and more. Now, there may be a couple more that you can get for starter three, but I'm thinking, only reason I ain't really just stri strictly talk about that in this video is because like, I'm thinking about just giving y'all your own video, kind of like I do for the swings. Like, I feel like the swing's the most popular builds, but I may have to do that for the uh, starter three. Because I think a lot more people, it's, it's, it's March, pretty much. And, yeah, I think a lot more people are going to be able to have those. So, I may just give y'all your own little video. But, yeah, today we're going to be giving y'all pretty much dribble animations. Everything you need and more. Without further ado, man, um, no more talking. Let's hop into it. Let's go! All right, next is going to be the dribble animations. Now, when it comes to dribble animations... I think we actually got a little bit of a mix-up on a couple of these. Now, um, I use Pro. Majority of my uh, swing builds don't really get debooked besides the 6'5 and the 6'6. Six, six. I got a 6'7 that could get it, but it's not maxed out. But, yeah, debook, 80 plus speed with ball, 6 under. So, swings, y'all can get this. 6'8s um, cannot get it. 6'9s cannot get it. You have to be 6'7 and under to get it. It says 6'10 and under, but there's no way you can have an 80 speed ball on any build taller than 6'7. So that's one thing to say in preference. But um, I think, honestly, if you're not putting on Michael Jordan, you're a swing, I'm going D-Book or Pro. Not really even looking at nothing else. But the best one in the game probably still is Kyrie Irving. So if you're a guard, use Kyrie Irving. If you don't get that, put on D-Book, Michael Jordan, or Pro. Simple as that. Next is the size up. Now, when it comes to the six size up, the best ones are for guards. So you got Steve Francis, you got Derek Rose. If I'm a guard, I use D Rose when I'm on my guard. Now, when it comes to my swing, I'm either using Jamal Murray or John Morant. Tracy McGrady is solid. De'Aaron Fox is solid, but I would probably say John Morant is probably actually the best. Next is the escape drill moves. Now, this one is very, very. I'm gonna be honest. D book escape not that bad. It's just not like the best. That's what I say. Um. I still think the ones that were good are the, pretty much the best ones. So you got the KDs, you got the Jimmy Butlers, you got the Trey Youngs, you got the Kevin Walkers, you got the, where is he at, De'Aaron De Foxes. Pretty much any of the ones that was the best ones in the game before this one, still the best ones in the game. It's kind of simple. All right, next is the regular breakdown combo. Do y'all actually use this? I actually am kind of curious. But I use De'Aaron Fox. I sometimes use Luka. But yeah, I use the Aaron Fox. Simple as that. Next is the aggressive breakdown combo. Now, this is another one. Um, I sometimes use Kobe. I don't get it on this build because I don't reach a requirement. But Kobe is solid. But on this build, I do use John Morant. And that's just pretty much what it is. Next is the combo moves. When it comes to the best combo moves, De'Aaron Fox, in my opinion, is the best one. But I ain't gonna lie. D-Book D 1 did not look bad at all. Next is the crossover. When it comes to the crossover, D-Book 1 is kind of slow. So, yeah, I'm going to just keep rocking out with the John Wall. John Wall has probably, like, the John Wall crossover is one of, like, actually, if you're a rim runner, it's, like, actually probably the most broken animation in the game. It's, like, really, really broken. Next is the behind the back. When it comes to the behind the back, man, it's a lot of ways you can really go about this. So, let's break it down. I broke it down so many times this year, but let's keep going. Now, it may be even some more, but in my opinion, it's really only three, in my honest opinion, that I'm really checking for. Now, if you're a guard guard, yeah, Stephen Curry, Trey Young, definitely great options. You probably could even say those are the two best. I still think Jamal Murray, De'Aaron Fox are the two best for what they do. If you want to do a move by the back, I'm going De'Aaron Fox. If you want to go explosive by the back, I'm going Jamal Murray. It's simple as that. Now, you got stuff like Curry. You got stuff like Trey Young that have both. And then you got stuff like DeMar DeRozan that have both. Simple as that. All right, next is the spin. Spin is interesting because you can go a lot of ways. Kobe, I honestly, like, I don't do this a lot, but I like I like some of the animation. Like, he putting it between his legs, spinning. That's hard to me. But I'll probably, probably keep on um, John Morant, to be honest. Next is the hesitation. Now, hesitation, I'm going to be honest. I have went through a lot of these. The ones that you would think are good, not even that good. Like, John Morant is, like, by far the best one. It's, like, by far the best one. Uh, Jimmy Butler, DeMar DeRozan are actually solid, 
But the rest of these is like the one the one I use Dazzy for, they're not even that good. Like they're not even like they're almost bad. So yeah, I, I would say John Morant is like damn near the best one. Now I use Chris Paul on occasion, like for the Sham God, but yeah, I'ma be honest, like yeah, just throw on John John Morant. You'll be alright. Alright, next is the step back. Uh you so you got really John Wall, Chris Paul. Those are really, really good. I think D Book is actually solid, but I don't think it's in the argument for either one of these two. I think John Wall is the best one though, personally. For me. If you think it's anything else, put on what you rather. Like put on what you know. We in season five. But if you really trying to try something new and you haven't tried John Wall, that's the best one. Um now I let me let me preference this. If you're a small guard, Curry is the best one. I ain't gonna lie. Curry, Curry is pretty solid. But I would say John Wall may even be better than Curry because the hot back. But if you do want to do like the pullback, Curry may have a better pullback than, than John Wall. I'm not even going to cap. All right, next is the triple threat style. Now, when it comes to the triple threat style, this can be any way. Did, like, I don't know why they made Michael Jordan a, a starter three animation. That is insane. But Devin Booker, Kobe Bryant, Stephen Curry, those are the three. Um, I'm gonna be using I may even move more to D book at one point. I was using Kobe. I got off of it I don't know what the hell y'all was talking about curry clears in my opinion But it's not bad, but like curry is just far better, but D book I think I think that's gonna be one I like all right next is the past out now if you didn't know I do plan on also doing a a Video where I rank every single pass out. So I've already ranked that on the dunks. I've ranked all the layups I did a video testing pretty much all the jump shots um, I am gonna do a video testing or not testing but ranking all the drum animations But y'all gotta show support on them videos. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna give y'all another one to show support on before I Stick my foot into doing every dribble animation. Maybe that'd be fade. Maybe that'd be the pass style But best pass style in the game in my opinion It's gotta be a it's, it's between these I think the Aaron Fox in my opinion for how I play the Aaron Fox John Morant solid Bet some of the best bang for your buck, but when it comes to those high tiers, I don't really see the argument for not saying Lamella Ball, Tyrese Halliburton, or Magic. Magic, if you really just playing the game for fun and want to see some crazy animations, but if you really want the best ones for dots, I would say Tyrese Halliburton and Lamella Ball. The most underrated one, Trey Young. Jokic and Sabonis are really solid too, but Trey Young is super underrated. It's super underrated. But yeah, man, that's gonna be the end of this video. That was the dribble animations. Um, we went over everything in this video, dribble animations wise, crossovers, breakdowns, scapes, six size ups, dribble styles, triple threat styles. It don't matter, but we went over every single possible animation when it comes to dribbling, the best of the best, or what I just refer. It just don't really matter. Um, now, I will be honest. The things that I favor, you may not favor. So I would just say, bro, especially when it comes to dribbling, if you don't dribble the same way, it may not work for you. So everything I'm gonna tell y'all is not gonna probably be the best. But at the end of the day, I'm still giving y'all the extra options so that you can find what works for you. Because it what, what, what worked for me, especially on dribble animations, what worked for me may not work. For you it's that simple i don't really know how else to really explain that um but yeah uh that's gonna be the end of this video you guys do want more make sure to like the video hopefully you like the video subscribe if you new man without further ado man it's your boy fits might have been man all of my friends are dead leave them in the cold put them in the tundra i go right charles i cannot see her i make a fumble i was just a tissus with a leah pussy a jungle tell them to bring me my money yeah